the town is about as picturesque and beautiful a place as you can imagine in New England. We are listed in the travel book of a thousand places to see before you die. Located in the mountains of southern Vermont, Grafton is a picture-perfect little village. Some say it even looks like a movie set. Many of its historic buildings have been restored by its residents. There's only around 600 of them and the Wyndham Foundation. The Wyndham Foundation's role really is truly unique in the way that it's just here to preserve the town. It started in 1963 by Dean Maddy, a financial investment banker from Princeton, New Jersey. He loved coming here. And when it was kind of crumbling, he figured he wanted to restore this. It was a very special place for him. He started by purchasing and revamping the Grafton Inn in 1965. Innkeeper Angela Comstock. The inn was built in 1790. It became an inn in 1801. It's one of the longest continuing operating inns in the country. Guests have included Nathaniel Hawthorne, Ulysses S. Grant, and Theodore Roosevelt. People come here, they sit on the porch, they relax, they hike the trails, they just take it all in. We've got about 10 miles of hiking specific trails and then another 10 miles of mountain bike trails. Including single track mountain biking. Single track mountain bike riding would be your real kind of technical mountain bike. And this is what a lot of people come to Vermont to do and experience mountain biking. We have hand built mountain bike trails. So a lot of technical features. We've got rocks, roots, wooden features, bridges. That's what's drawing people here to ride on our trails specifically. No single track riding for me, but I did enjoy cruising along on my fat tire bike. Woo! The Grafton Inn is open. Guests hoping to travel during the first half of October must call to make a reservation. And of course, check Vermont's cross-state travel guidelines before your trip. And that is Chronicle for tonight. Thanks so much for joining us, everyone. I'm Anthony Everett. Have a good evening, good weekend. Hope to see you back here on Monday night.